Hi, Kevin. So kind of a follow-up question from our previous conversation in terms of networking. We all know that networking is a very important key or strategy when searching for a job. As we mentioned in the previous video, we don't go directly ask people for a job. So we build relationship and then from there, it can grow to asking for help. So if you, do you have any tips in terms of networking, especially nowadays, everyone is online, they can do via LinkedIn. What can you tell us? I think that when it comes to networking, LinkedIn is a very good tool. Yes. If you're building connections and you're, you're not just uh, worried about yourself, let's say someone posts something and you give them a nice comment or you support their content, you're starting to build relationships that way. Because obviously if someone's putting out content, they want it to be loved, liked by others. So that's critically important. So I do think LinkedIn is an important place if done correctly to make connections, build that awareness, likability, and trust that we've been talking about and building those friends before you need anything. But if you need a job, right? You don't just network with the people who you think are in a position to give you a job. You network with like-minded individuals and think about mutual benefit, not just what you could get out of the relationship. Yeah. So that key thing that is so important is that, let's say you want to get a job at a particular company, mm. make some friends at the company. You don't have to tell them the reason why I'm making friends with you today mm -hmm. is because I need a job tomorrow <laughs> or I need a job yesterday because you know things are getting rough, it's a pandemic. So, I mean, we just need to be cool about it. And that's what cool cow marketing is all about. Yeah. You want yeah. to, just like you want to attract customers instead of chasing them, mm -hmm. you want to attract employers instead of being one of 1,000 resumes. One of the things that I, I tell people recently is that if you need a resume to start the process of getting a job, you're probably not going to get it. You know, <laughs> most of the jobs out there now, it's like, Someone knows someone who knows someone, and the resume is a formality. Yes. Yeah. And do you think that when sending LinkedIn connection, is it important to leave a message? Hi, Calvin, I saw you somewhere and you talked something. I'm interested. Let's connect. Is it important to have that message or just send connect, 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 connect? <laughs> <laughs> connect? Well, nobody wants to feel like they're one of many right people yeah. want to feel special and yeah. people want to be acknowledged and complimented so if you can if you can compliment the person on some on something that you like about them or something you like about what they posted yeah. that's that's going to help you instead of just lazily just yeah. being a robot if you're a human being people will like you if you're yourself some people will like you and some people won't like you. At the end of the day, don't be a robot. Be a human being, make that human connection, and you will find the right people. Not everybody's gonna like you, but that's All okay. Right. That's okay. And that's how we connected. I saw you, you were in a, another broadcast, and I reached out to you and said that, hey, Calvin, I saw you and let's connect. And then we kind of built a relationship. Now we are here interviewing you. That's how it works. Exactly. And now, Here's the reality. Uh, we connected on LinkedIn. Yes. And he said, okay, can I come on the podcast? Can I come answer some interview questions? Yeah. Yes. And then you build a relationship from there. Now yeah. I'm getting to know you, know more about your business, know more about what you do, and know that you're willing to give to your community. You're not just taking from it. Yes. So now you're building awareness, likability, and trust. Mm -hmm. That's what we're doing here. Yeah. We're not just grabbing what we could grab. That's correct. It's a two-way communication. Two-way benefit should be. Mm -hmm. Thank you for that, Calvin. And again, for the audience watching or listening, if you have any other tips in terms of networking, please leave comments below. And tune in next time for another great question with Calvin.